guys welcome back it's crystal sky and good morning to you all and i usually do this at the end of my videos but i hope guys that you like and subscribe and help my family grow and stay safe and let's move on with the video so today i'm doing a challenge that i've been seeing that it's been trending around youtube lately i think it's been trending this year anyway but it's called my face full of makeup so oh man sorry guys i'm kind of out of breath right now i just woke up a couple of minutes ago so i'm sorry if i am out of breath and as you see guys the scenery is a little bit different i'm actually sitting at my work table my homework table and i have everything set up beside me so um the full face of makeup pretty much challenge is where you have to do your face full of makeup so it's not like you put a lot of foundation then no i am going to do a full face of makeup as in i'm going to do kind of like a glowy look and as you guys know i don't usually do that if it, i only do that like on special occasions and if i do do it usually my mom like helps me or she fix fixes like my mistakes because I'm not very good at makeup, so this is going to be hard, but let's begin. So usually the first thing, I watched a lot of videos yesterday and I do have like a small like compact mirror over here that I'm going to be looking into because I do not have a big one. So uh, first thing I watched on the video, I watched a lot of videos last night before falling asleep. So first thing you have to do is make sure to prime your face. So you either do it with a face moisturizer or you do it with a face primer. I unfortunately do not have a face primer. Like I said, I usually don't like do face full of makeup. So just using my classical hand moisturizer that you saw in my previous video. So I'm going to just put it on my face. So I will be using my camera guys as, um, yeah, I will be using my camera as my use of a mirror like when i put this on i'm going to be using my camera as my use for the mirror so if i stare right at you guys sorry i am staring not at you i'm staring at the camera or at the face that i can see because i'm doing this on my phone you guys so okay i got my face kind of moisturized and i'm sorry if my like phone's too far away Oops. Hold on. Okay, I think you should see me better now. But yeah, guys, so we got my face moisturized. So now, guys, I am going to start off with the makeup. The problem is, guys, it's really hard to determine my skin tone because I either my skin tone is either this color, like really, really light, or it's my mom's color. And just for safety measures, I'm going with my mom's color. With I think it's a little bit darker than mine. So I'm gonna take my sponge and I'm carefully going to dip it on to my face. So I'm really nervous. Like I said, I do not usually do this. I do not usually put full face makeup on my face. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to squirt makeup on my bottom face so I do not usually like I said I do not usually do this <laughs> sorry guys if I look super weird right now but yeah I do not usually do this guys I do not do this because my mom always says guys and I'm sure a lot of moms say this. You're not supposed to put makeup on your skin if you're like too young, unless it's emergency. Because guys, it ruins your skin by a lot. And that to me already seems like a warning sign. So... <laughs> So I, the fact that I'm doing this is a 
if I am putting my face on makeup, I do apologize. I did say that I usually do not do this. Okay, let me try something else, guys. So let me try another technique, which is using my fingers, which I'm pretty sure I'm going to horribly regret. <laughs> Yeah, so which I'm gonna horribly regret. I'm not sure, guys, if you could see this. Hold on. Okay, guys, so I'm kind of failing at the makeup foundation thing part of this challenge. So, oh my god, guys, I'm horrible. Like, I'm not a horrible person. That's not what I meant. I meant, like, I'm horrible when it comes to this. <laughs> so, guys... I do apologize if this is going to be a failure video because like I said, I did not. All right guys, so I am going to now put my makeup on my forehead. So put just a little bit. I usually don't put a lot on my forehead for, uh, well, for many reasons. Many reasons guys that I usually do not put makeup on my forehead is because usually my forehead is the cleanest part of my of my face because usually my like acne i guess yeah like my acne usually is on the lower part of my face and not my upper part on my face so that's usually guys why i never put any sort of makeup on my forehead even when i do my makeup i only put up where i see my acne I don't do a full face makeup. I only put it where my acne and I only put it if it's really like really, really, really horrible that day or that month. But okay, so I did my face with the makeup. I can't even, I can't even tell even guys like, oh my God, I'm horrible. But anyway, I am going to bring it down to my neck. So I'm gonna squirt a little bit more on the sponge and I'll bring it down to my neck. I might not be very good at makeup, but I do know that if you want it to look realistic, bring it down to your neck, that your neck and your uh, potentially your face matches your neck. If it doesn't match, people are going to be like, oh, what the hell? And it does not match your neck. So do that's what I learned over the years. I only started makeup guys last year. I was the type of, I was kind of like a tomboy, I guess. I wasn't like into makeup. I didn't like find it interesting. But as I grew up older a little bit, I actually found it really interesting. So yeah, I'm going to put a little bit more on my face. I'm probably going to regret this, but I'm putting it onto my face. All right, guys. So I got my foundation done, or at least I hope I did it right. Tell me guys in the comments if it matches. If it doesn't, I do apologize. Like I say, I don't usually do foundation. My mom does it for me. I suck up foundation. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> but okay, next thing is, like I said, I do not have a lot of products, so I have no idea. Oh shoot, hold on guys. I'm gonna be right back quickly. So sorry guys, I forgot one product that I left out and it's translucent powder because I saw a video where you kind of have to bake your face or at least that's what it's called. So apparently it's called baking your face. Hello well, guys, the camera is just falling. It is like leaned up against my tripod because I'm using my camera. But anyway guys, that's my face. And so now, apparently, a lot of girls contour their face by putting by putting translucent powder on to like their nose crack and stuff. So I'm gonna end up doing it. So I'm gonna take a beauty blender and I'm going to dip it into the foundation. And I guess I'm going to apparently what girls call cook your face <laughs> it's so 
sounds so weird when I said, but yeah, it's called cooking your face, and apparently you you have to put it under your eyes and under your on a little bit on your forehead. <coughs> God, I'm okay, guys. I'm okay, but yeah, apparently you're supposed to cook your face. By the way, guys, all my store bought products are all from a drugstore except this one because me and my mom have the same guy's skin color so me and my mom share this because we have the same uh, skin tone so that's the only thing that's not going to be from the drugstore guys most of my products are from the drugstore since I don't usually do my makeup like other girls my age do a lot of girls, guys my age, from my class, they usually, they do, like, a lot. So, yeah, guys, apparently I'm supposed to cook my face, so I'm not really sure how to do this. I'm just putting in a little bit under my eyes and a little bit, just a little, tiny little bit on my cheeks. But, yeah. So, I guess this is how I cook my face. I don't know. Guys, like I said, tell me in the comments if my skin, or even text me guys on Instagram, which I will leave down below in the description. So just go on your phone, find me, and tell me guys if I did, if, if I'm doing this right, sorry. Gosh, this smells horrible. But next thing, I saw a video where a girl's contour, or whatever it's called, my face feels so smooth, guys. Damn. Okay, so apparently they put a little bit of foundation or something like that to make their skin lighter or darker. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use another shade, which is this one. I'm going to put it a little bit on my... So I'm, it does have like an applicator. So I'm not going to use this. I was going to use it, but I forgot this had it. So I'm going to put it under my eyes. And apparently you're supposed to blend it out. Oh my gosh. Yeah, apparently you're supposed to blend that out. I usually do not blend anything under my eyes, just as a disclaimer. I do not blend anything under my eyes and I will probably have to cook this because I think you do the cooking after, I think. Yeah, I think so. I can't remember. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm pretty sure this looks horrible. Wait. Ah! <laughs> this is not my skin color, guys. This is not... Oh man, that was a mistake. That was a mistake. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a few pumps of this dip it on my finger and i'm gonna fix the little mistake that i just made so so far guys i am failing horribly at this whole makeup thing oh my god i just ruined the whole thing guys ah <laughs> even though like even though i'm trying to take this serious i cannot help but like not take this seriously guys i'm trying to take it as serious as humanly possible for me so yeah all right guys so i don't know guys i don't know i honestly i have no idea i mean it looks pretty good guys i don't know I have no idea guys, I have no idea. Oh, I feel scared. Looks pretty okay, but let's move on to the next thing. I'm gonna not do anything to my face anymore because I'm kind of scared. We're gonna bake again. I'm gonna dip a little bit of this brush right here. Oops. Damn it, my mascara fell. Okay, I'll pick that up later. I'll find it later. Hold on, guys. 
I just found this. Never mind. Okay, sorry. But I'm gonna bake my face with this brush. This also came in a brush. This also came, guys, in a brush set. My mom got this as a gift, but she said I can have it. So I'm like, okay. I'm gonna put a little bit on my forehead. Gosh, I'm telling you guys, so far I'm failing at this whole makeup thing. There we go. I baked my face. I think. Oh gosh, I know for a fact you're probably laughing guys right now because I never do this. This is turning out so horrible. <coughs> I got translucent powder everywhere guys, legit everywhere. I usually don't use it, I just bought it because I saw my stepsister using it. So I'm like, what an interesting product. But anyway guys, next thing I'm gonna do is move on to the actual doing of my eyes now. I'm gonna take this brush right here and I'm gonna do my eyes. So my eyeshadow palette is unfortunately broken by my baby sister. She dropped it, but here it is. So I'm using, I'm gonna use this one at the corner. So I'm gonna use this one and I'm gonna just do like a simple little So guys, this is what I'm doing. I'm not sure if this is gonna end good because, oh wait, okay guys, never mind. I'm gonna use this brush instead because I forgot that one I used for makeup, for lipstick, for lip gloss for my sister and I just, oh my God, I just screwed that up. But I'm gonna put that onto my crease. I'm telling you guys, I'm horrible when it comes to makeup. I am just, I'm terrible at it. I'm honestly just terrible at makeup. Like, I am not usually, okay, I'm gonna actually switch back to it. I know it's like a little bit sticky, but it did apply my makeup pretty well, so. So I got like, uh, I keep switching between two guys, just so you know, I keep switching between two to ease my makeup a little bit. So guys, let me see. So this is what I got so far. Pretty simple look. Very simple, very like not so, yeah, so pretty simple. What? Next color I'm gonna use is kind of like a peachy color. Actually, wait, now let me just rub my brush. I'm not gonna use a peach color. I'm going to use a light pink that is below it to just lighten the color just a little bit for my crease. Just gonna lighten that color just a little bit. It's just like a simple little look. And I'm actually really loving this, guys. Like I say, I barely do my makeup, so the fact that I'm loving this is already like set to be blessed. I'm gonna go back to the first color that I did, which is this one. Wait, let me try and show. I wanna try and show. It's this one, this the one I'm using right now. So I'm gonna go back to the first one, the top one. And I'm just going to fix a little bit on this side because I can kind of feel that it's kind of uneven. So I'm going to kind of just do on this side. And my challenge for today is I'm going to wear this makeup all day and I'm going to go out with it. So I am meeting my friends later on. I know we're all in quarantine and stuff like that, but... I count them as family and my mom said that she doesn't mind because sometimes we see our friends in the park and we talk to them, we don't avoid them. So, <laughs> you're probably wondering what happened guys because the mirror's covering but I just got it in my eye so ouch. Ouch, but props to me. 
for taking from. I'm gonna darken the shade. All right, guys, so I did my eyes, so. Tell me, guys, what you think. I think I did pretty good for someone that barely does this. I don't know. I think I did pretty good. They look pretty even, and I do like the color. I will not do it under my crease. I will not, like, do it under my eyes. I cannot do that. But for this video, for the sake of the video, I will <laughs> try. So I do have a smaller br brush, and I will try to. So I'm going to do the one that I just did, which is a light pink under my eyes so guys if you can't stand this part i suggest you guys skip it this video is really going on for so long guys But there we go. So we got that part done. It's kind of hard to tell, but I got that part done. Done, not down, down. <laughs> Sorry. But yeah, I got that done. So now what we're gonna do, as for a last thing, last thing, is we're gonna curl our eyelashes and put some bronzer. So I have this hard candy bronzer. It smells like cupcakes. My sister hates it, but I think it's either cupcakes or vanilla. So I'm going to take this brush. I'm just going to bronze my cheeks. So I usually don't do this. So I'm, I'm not sure even if I'm using the right brush. Okay guys, so I think I'm pretty done with the bronzer, I think. I don't know guys, I'm telling you guys I'm a horrible makeup. I will not do my eyebrows, just as a disclaimer, my eyebrows look horrible guys, I cannot. So now I'm gonna just curl my eyelashes and put some mascara on. So I have my eyelash and curler, which I got. I'm gonna curl my eyelashes. I usually do not, I usually don't curl them. So I curl my eyelashes, putting my mascara on, which is the Pop, Popa or v Vamp one. I got this from Ezreal as a gift from my stepdad's parents. So, really nice. My mom also has one. And I'm only putting it on my upper. <gasps> oh man, guys, I just ruined my makeup by doing that. I'm only putting it on my upper ones. Alright guys, so I got, and my eyelashes are real by the way, so people that will comment or like some on Instagram, they're fake, they're fake. Guys, my eyelashes aren't extensions, I was born with them. So like, there they are. I don't know, I feel like I need to put a little bit more on this side. I don't know why, but guys, I am failing horribly at this, I'm sorry if this video is super long. But I'm like... And like I said, I am doing this only on my... I don't 
know guys I just I'm pretty sure I just ruined the whole thing <laughs> I don't know guys I think I just ruined the whole thing but yeah that's pretty much the whole thing for my makeup the next the last thing is the setting spray and my lips so I'm not gonna really do my lips because I don't really have a lip um but I'm just going to hold on quickly get my lip balm Alright guys, so I searched for it, here it is, and it's just a regular EOS, I'm not going to be putting any sort of type of like lip gloss or anything on my lips, even though it's supposed to be the full makeup challenge. Mm -mm. And there you go guys so that's all for the makeup thing and let's just add the setting spray this is the long wear setting spray from again the drugstore this thing smells bad but let's spray it as you see guys I'm kind of scared but let's guys so we got that sprinkled all on my face and god damn it i just ruined the shirt i put on this is a new wash shirt so ah yeah but guys my challenge for today is to wear this whole thing the whole day so <laughs> this is, will surely be a challenge so i hope you enjoyed that video guys and i will take this off maybe after a video maybe a couple minutes after a video i'll see well, i hope you enjoyed the video and i will maybe try to make more makeup videos bye guys please subscribe please like please help my family grow and i hope that you guys all stay safe see you guys